So in 2014, when we look at the activity in cyber squatting and the misuse of domain names, we see through the WIPO Arbitration and Mediation Centre that once again the number of cases of alleged cyber squatting that were filed rose. It's now, or last year it was 2,600 odd uh, new cases and they, they covered about 5,600 domain names because one case can cover more than one alleged misuse of a domain name. Uh, so continued vigilance is needed on the part of uh, trademark owners to ensure that there is no unfair hijacking of their reputation, image and brand within the domain name system, which of course is an increasingly important uh, area and space for uh, electronic commerce of all natures and varieties. Uh, as you know, the Internet uh, Corporation for Assigned Names and Numbers, ICANN, is in the process of unveiling new top-level domains, potentially 1,400 such top-level domains. A top-level domain is what you find to the right of the dot, such as .com. .com is the top-level domain. Uh, so far, 500 new top-level domains have been introduced, and we now see that that is entering into the case activity or entering into uh, the activity of uh, alleged cases of cyber squatting. About 4% of our cases last year covered those 500 new top-level domains. Of course, they're much less mature than the older top-level domains, but we see activity increasing. Again, a message for enterprises that they need to be vigilant about the protection of their reputation, their brand, their image in uh, uh, the electronic space across all domains, old domains and new domains.